CTP 11. And I actually made this column a little longer than normal, about 120 centimeters, just to see if it would propagate, and it does. So I'm here um, above Hebgen Lake. I'm on a southwest facing slope, and that's important because we're only finding around here these near surface facets, these, these kind of loose faceted grains. Uh, breaking clean in these tests on southwest aspects. I'm not even seeing them on all of the aspects, but it's definitely here. This is the new snow that we got uh, the, late last week, and actually in the last uh, Thursday and Friday. This snow is why we had a warning down here, because we were concerned about uh, the stress that this new snow and the weight of this on this layer of, of facets. Um, it has not been as reactive as we had thought, um, but I'm still concerned about this. Um, I'm only on a 27 degree slope here. If I was going to ski on something a lot steeper on a southwest aspect, I would definitely be heads up. Um, and I recommend that you dig, because it's really easy to dig, it's only a foot and a half under, to see if you have this, these faceted grains. And a quick stability test is going to let you know whether or not you have it. And uh, if you don't have it, I recommend you dig at least another pit, if not two, to look for to make really sure that the slope you're about to get on does not have this, this snow.